Hello and welcome to my first Minecraft mod pack let's play series. And in this series we are playing... Uh, how do you pronounce that? <laughs> I call it Enigmatica. It rolls kind of nicely off the tongue, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> but anyways, this is the mod pack that we are playing. I did a vote on my Discord server if you would like to see this let's play and people voted yes. Now. There are different um, game modes of this. I believe there's a Skyblock version, there's an expo Expert mode. I asked if I should play this the uh, Normal mode or the Expert mode and people voted for Normal mode. So here we are. If you haven't joined my Discord server yet, be sure to join it. Link down below. But let's get started. New Let's Play series. My first mod pack Let's Play series. As you can see, there are currently 263 mods loaded. I hope the music isn't too loud. It shouldn't be. I hope everything is fine. So, yeah, let's get right to it. As you can see, I made a test world just to see what was going on. Let's create a Let's Play series. That's, of course, going to be survival. Um, we have biomes to plant in here, which is really cool. It adds a ton of new biomes to Minecraft. Bonus chest off. We don't need that. Allow cheats? No. Um, I don't know if the preview works where you can kind of see a preview of the map that you are um, starting on. Well, that is apparently not working. Oh, there we go. There we go. It is generating the area where we're going to spawn in, but it's heating up my memory. Memory. Um, let's just stop the generation. You know what? We'll see it how it is. Also, I will be changing the seed, so that will not matter either way. So here we have the seed. I'm going to change it to binaries enigmatica to let's play. So if you want the same world, you can do that. I will post the seed down below in the description. Also, I should say that I'm running this mod pack using multi MC. Multi MC allows you to have many different Minecraft installations. Um, or I shouldn't say installations, but many Minecraft, different Minecraft instances or mod packs together without you needing to have the Curse Forge um, launcher and stuff. You can just download it. So this, for example, is a mod pack that's on Curse Forge. Normally, I would need to download the Twitch client and install it through there. But thanks to Multi MC, I can download it and get it through that. Um, if you want a tutorial on how to do that. Let me know down in the comment section below. But anyways, let's get to it. Create a new world. And let's see what Minecraft has to offer. All right, the world has been generated or are still being generated. Let's take a look at the world here. Hmm. Well, I gotta say we're at a... Um, we have plenty of wood. Let's just put it like that. <laughs> let's get down from here. I see some liquid over here. I want to see what that is. If it will show me, it will not show me. All right. Well, there are plenty of mods in this mod pack. Oh, okay. Some that I have never played with before and some that I actually have been playing with before. We also have a quest book. Now, what was tearing me between using exp playing expert mode and not playing expert mode it was actually the quest book because the quest books are different. Um, for example, this one, it kind of just lets you do whatever you wish, but in the expert mode, for example, mining, it is limited and you need to build your way up before you can start mining different resources. But it's not, it's not too bad. Everyone wants a double mode, so we'll play with double mode. Also, expert mode is really extremely hard in my opinion. So, yeah, so as you can see, we can do many different things. And once we have completed a quest, well, that's very nice. So, um, I think I will take as construct allows you to manually make tools, not the vanilla tools, but other tools. Um, so you can get into a little bit more detail when you make your tools. And what's this over here? Ooh. Ow. Okay. Oh. 
I'm flying. <laughs> okay, there's a lot of stuff that I don't know about, but there's also a lot of stuff that I know about. This is also in Minecraft 1.12.2. What's that? Oh, it's one of the slimes from that up there. That island is generated by Tigger's construct. Um, if you've got any questions about the mods and stuff that I do that you don't understand, be sure to let me know down in the comments below. But um, yeah, I think... I think I like this area, actually. <laughs> Chicken. Um, I think I like this area quite a bit. What's that? That's a structure, isn't it? Seems like structure. Maybe we'll be able to get shelter from that, but I think we need to get some basic tools going. Um, like a crafting table and everything, and we'll work our way up eventually. There are also some good caves here. I see some coal. So let's just get to it. Um, is Vein Miner a part of this mod? Not like that. Let's take a look at the controls here. Um, vein. Unless I can't spell it, I don't think it's here. But let's just take a quick look here. Inventory. Um, yeah, I think... I think we're good. I don't think there's vein miner in this one. There is vein miner in um, expert mode, but not in this one. I could add it myself. Let me know if you want me to add vein miner down in the comments below. But yes, so seems like we just got a punch wood, just like vanilla Minecraft. I think I probably will enable vein miner just to make things a little bit easier. But um, we'll get to that. We'll get to that eventually. <laughs> um, we also have GI over here, which is a very handy, not only craft guide, but also a help to when you craft. You could just click on a thing and everything gets put in your inventory. Ooh, slime ball, not bad. I think we'll be able to use those, so... I'll collect those, because why not? Um, as you probably get an axe, but I want to make... I don't want to make the Minecraft vanilla tools. I want to make the Tinker's Construct tools. Because I really like that mod. And I think it gives you... It gives you so many possibilities of different... Um, tools you can make. Like, you can make so many different pickaxes, because you can put... For example, as a pickaxe hit, you can put different things that give you different things, so like different durability, different um, mining speed and mining strength, different sort of stuff, kind of complicated, but it's really, really cool. Um, I think I've got to stop it here at around 20. There we go. And let's get all of this stuff out of the way. What's that? Deposit to be there by chests. I don't have any chests currently. I want to save a couple of wood just in case. So let's start by making a crafting table. And this is a Tinker's Construct crafting table because it holds the items in there, which I really like. Um, if we search on Tinker's Construct mainly and how to get the... As you can see, all of this are hits and bindings and stuff you can make for your tools. Um, I just tried to find the book, which I can't see for some reason. Um, book? Nope. All right. So, hmm. What is it called again? Let's get back here. Tigger's Construct. Materials at you. That's right. Materials at you. There we go. How to make that? Make that with a book and blank pattern. Okay. So I need that first. Um, actually, I don't need that first. You know what? I don't need it first. Let's just make a couple of these blank patterns here. I don't need to start off with doing all this, but um, I like to. I like to doing it. I just need to get a craft table. I need to search a table. Because then we have... A uh, stencil table, for example. See, you can just press a plus and boom, it's there. Let's go to Tigger's Construct. I haven't played with mods for a very, very long time, so I'm going to be a little, little bit rusty. 
so I'm gonna try and warm up here. There we go. Okay, so that um, definitely gonna need a paddle chest. How to make a chest? Uh, yeah, that's doable. Boom, just like that. Um, tool station, gotta need that too. So like you could just boom, boom, tool station, boom, done, easy. And I think I already got one of those, don't I? Yeah, right here. So there, there, and there, boom. So let's get a, you know what, let's, mm, I need a first of all, Park Builder. Right, so first I need to get it here. Where is it? There we go. So put those in there. I could get a pickaxe hit and I will be needing a tool rod and I will be needing a binding just like that. And I'm gonna need a bit more of these. So let's just put, nope, <laughs> not like that. Put those in there. Uh, okay, so then we go to here and we make some wooden stuff. Can I do that? Yes. All right. Can we do it with slime? No. Okay. That would have been a, that would have been a little bit weird. Material cost two. There we go. Just have to find the right one. Right there. And then we can go into here. Pickaxe. Boom, boom, boom. It's not that good, but it'll keep us going. Um, let me get some stone up here so we can get some stone tools. And I want to check that building out over there. And see what we can get. The cool thing with these tools as well is that you can repair them. When they break, they don't completely break. You can repair them with the same material as you made the pickaxe hidden. Um, as far as I remember, that is. So that is pretty cool. Uh, oh, there's some coal. Perfect. I've got to wait with getting that till I have a stone pickaxe and stone tools. Um, but yes, I believe... Oh, oh, there we go. Just a little bit laggy. Um, I believe this is mostly a tech pack, so like... um, It mostly involves tech and machines and stuff, which is exactly what I want. I really like that sort of stuff. So that fits perfectly with me. Um, I don't know if we'll get into every single mod that is in the pack, but we'll have to see. The sun is going down, so if I could get a bid, that would be really, really handy. Um, are there any sheep around? Speaking of sheep, there's... Is that... No, that's not a sheep. That probably won't drop any wool. Um, yeah, I probably need to make a quick shelter. If we get back down here... Um, I don't know what's gonna be out at night, so you know what, um, that's a lot of slimes. I'm gonna take this stuff with me, and we're gonna dig in somewhere, just to be safe. Because I don't know what's coming out at night, other than the slimes, so you know what, right here we'll do fine. Let's go right in here. And I'll cover it up. There we go. But those slimes are really gonna be annoying to listen to, aren't they? Yeah, get out of here. Thank you. <laughs> uh, now we just have to deal with the small ones, but we can we can live with that. We also need some food, so this is perfect because. We're getting a lot of stone here. Right. Let me just make a couple of torches. Uh, what's this? Tiny coal. Alright, do that. It's not safe out there, I don't think. We'll have to see. There we go. Alright. You know what? I would just gotta block that up for now. I don't feel safe. <laughs> so let's get some more tools. Um Let's get all of those in there. First of all, let's get this in there. Let's get shovel and let's get a pickaxe. Sorry, an axe. And let's get a sword as well. For that, I need a sword binding 
and I think that's everything. So let's put those in there. Pot builder, so we can make some stone stuff. How about that? Stone pickaxe. And I think what we can do is just go to the tool station, put this in and upgrade our current one. And then just do that to repair it. That's pretty cool. That's what I really like about this. So let's put this, let's get two bindings, two tool rods there. Let's get a shovel head. Um, you can't get a, hmm, interesting. Can you get a wooden one? Yeah. Hmm. I guess it kind of makes sense. There we go. All right. And let's get to the tool station. Let's get an axe. Boom, boom, boom. Hatchet, rather, actually. And stone. Boom. And I just need one more of this. And then I need the... What's the sword thingy? There we go. Make a stone sword. And <laughs> I'm still getting used to everything, all right? Let's get that through. And durability, not great, but it'll last for a little bit. All right, so I currently have no way of getting the quest unlocked in the quest book, mainly because I don't have any paper to make a book. Now I don't have a bed either, so I can't sleep until the night passes. Wow, okay, that did not last long. Broken already. Durability one. Yeah, that's not gonna last. <laughs> Why can't I make a stone hit? Oh, now I can. I wasn't able to before. Well then, let's fix that. Durability 16. Better than before, that's for sure. Let's get the dirt. There we go. And let's get a furnace going. Let's get a furnace going. I would really like to see what's in that structure over there. So I'll probably just wait out the night. And so we can see what that structure contains. But I really need some food. Um, we got some wool, but it's not enough. What's out here? Dare I go look? I hear footsteps. I don't think it's safe. <laughs> I'm gonna leave that for the daytime. Let's do that after. Um, what can we use with these slime balls? Just as regular slime balls, apparently. And a few other things. Okay, cool. But as you can see, we got tons and tons of mods here. Drying. Huh, interesting. Well, we got to take a look at that later on. Um, I think that's everything. Yeah, I think that's pretty much everything. Don't have any more food to cook. Yeah, I think I'm just going to have to... Wait out the night here. And yeah, I guess I'll be right back. Let me just change the controls here real, real quick. Let's do that and let us do that. Perfect, so now I can see you. <laughs> All right, well, I'll be here till I'm, whoa. Get out of here, thank you. I'll be here till uh, morning, and yeah, I'll be right back. See you in the morning. I'm not editing the episode yet. What's that? Oh boy. <laughs> See you in the morning. One second. All right, the sun is now up. I can now get outside. I have heard a zombie during the night, and I would like to get his flesh, because I believe I can make something. I can make food out of it because they are drying racks, which means I can. Whoa, 
Ooh, that's a long way down cave. And what's that? That is... Come on. That is... Appetite. Cool. Oh, that is... Okay. Nice. Um, okay, so... Yeah, there are some structures over there. I want to check those out. Actually, I'm going to make a quick bookmark. Or bookmark? <laughs> um, a real quick marker over here. Um, I believe it is... Oh, cool. Um, J? Yes. All right. Perfect. Um, sorry if that was a bit loud. Let's see. All right. Got it. I had to set the key. Let's give the name... Um, first night. Let's just call it that. Let's give it that. Save. And it's not going to show here, but as you can see on the minimap itself, it is shown first night. So now we can always get back here. Actually, there it is. You could just see it right there. Right there it is. First night. Now I can go ahead and take a look at that weird structure. Because there might be stuff that we can use to start our adventure. It even gives us a little beam. So that's perfect. Um, yeah, let's get over to the structure and take a look what's there. If it's tough in there with monsters and whatnot, we'll wait with it. But if it's just open, then why not just go for it, right? Might as well. So we are going to do that grab some wood on the way because why not and ooh, apples wait a minute can I just oh I can right click them nice How about that one not done I don't think that done no but I got some of them I got one so that's nice okay this hill is being a problem <laughs> I need to make a bridge if I'm gonna stay here, I definitely need a bridge between all these. And what I'm just gonna do that instead. There we go. All right. The structures. Yes, the structures right over here. It looks like an old castle. Yeah, it is an old castle. What's that? Black flower. Cows. You know, I do need leather. Did I get leather? I got no leather. I need a leather. Give me leather. No leather. Wonderful. Um, hmm. Let's see if anything is on the other side. I don't want to get stuck in there. If something were to um, come at me or something. Oh boy. This is not easy, is it? Break you. Get up here. Nope. Come on. Oh, really? Oh boy. <laughs> okay. You know what? Maybe we should just wait with this area until next time. I think maybe. Because I'm not getting anywhere with this. It's way too... It's way too secure, even though it's this... Very old, obviously. Oh, there we go. Um, oh, doesn't even look like there's anything in there, to be honest. Ow. Okay, well, now I made it. I mean... There's a lot of charcoal. Guess we can spend the night here. Oh, there's a furnace running. There must be a basement around here somewhere. But I think I'm going to cut the first episode here. Oh, there we go. If I can just get around. How do I get in there? That's a good place. Let me check that out. Open roof, but I mean, not too bad. Not bad at all. Can definitely use this place for something. But yes, I think we are gonna call it here. Actually, that's a book. I can get books from that. 
You know what? Let's complete a quest real quick. Um, do we have a crafting table? Yes, we do. Let's just quickly make some sticks and then a quick blank pattern like that. And let's complete. I don't think it will complete the first quest, actually. Let's take a look here. Um, back, Tinker's Construct. I need eight blank patterns. Eight. I can make that. I think. Need eight. <laughs> eight. I'm gonna need these blank patterns anyways. There we go. Quest completed. Um, I can claim a loot chest. I'm just gonna claim one. I can only claim one. And there we go, and then it opens up to other quests as well. Mainly loot chests. I hope we get other stuff as well. I don't know, let's go to industrial craft for example, and let's go to... Hmm, seems like it's only loot chests. But anyways, that's pretty cool. Oh, <laughs> that's a lot of stuff. You know what, let's just get all of them. Oh, okay. When they're blue, that means they're complete. Well, that's a lot of claiming to do. Wow. Claim. 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 And claim. Phew. All right. Well, we'll get to the other stuff at another time. Wait. I did, did it. I did do it. All right. Okay. I'm going to fiddle with that at another time. Um, extreme chill. Cool. Sleeping mat. Ooh, a portable bed. Nice. Umbra and sapling. Factory block pipes. It's a, oh, it's from chisel. Okay, cool. Well then, I hope you enjoyed our first episode in the Enigmatica 2. Let's play series. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, remember to leave a like, comment, and share with your friends. And if you're new to the channel, remember to subscribe. I might as well. I might also gonna keep that off. I might also do some live streams with this because there will have to be done a lot of mining and stuff like that, which is kind of boring to watch, but maybe not in a stream. So I think I might be doing some of that. Is that gravel over there? I think it might be. I got a lot of stuff to do. <laughs> but yes, hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you next time. Have a nice day. Bye bye.